Hi everyone, welcome to the Graceful Skinny Vlogs. We have now finished up our pre-K custom kit end of year review series and I was asked over on the Temper Doodle Homeschoolers group on Facebook, um, that's the parent group, not the official one, um, but I was asked on that group to um, do a review specifically on the Magic School Bus Science Lab kits that I found recently at a at Barnes & Noble on clearance. Um, it was I got it right at the end of the school year when they were doing a clearance um, of the school stuff. So I guess to make room for what they call summer for their summer stuff. Um, I paid 20 bucks for them. I think they're normally 40 for what you get. I'm pretty happy. I'm ecstatic with it at 20. I'd be pretty happy with it at 40. Um, and I would say I got these for my young child. We'll be doing kindergarten in the fall. And um, with the idea of doing it in some in kindergarten, first and second grade, um, I could see this working for pretty much all of elementary school, maybe a little bit in the middle school. I think that might be stretching it. If it's an older sibling wanting to have fun with the younger ones, it, they could probably definitely learn something with it. But as a full-on curriculum for a middle schooler, eh, I don't think so. So let me get right into what's, what what comes in it. Um, there, Everything comes in a cardboard bus. Um, they are saran wrapped when you get them normally. Mine weren't, but that's because it was in clearance and they were the last two there. Um, in the hood of the bus... And the hood of the bus is the, are the experiment cards. They're laminated. They're like laminated note, thicker note cards. Um, not quite laminated, but they're 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 nice. They're durable. Um, this is the in, the first one is an index card of what comes in it. So that's the and this is the chemistry lab bus that I am showing you. So those are the labs that are in there. Um, then you've got a couple of inform in information cards that are in here. Just some for the adults. And then there's the one where it shall tells you who the students are. And then it kind of gets into teaching the kids about lab safety and what's in your kit. So this is what's in the kit. So don't have to unpack everything. Or at least of everything that's supposed to be in the kit. Um, I haven't actually gone through completely yet um, to verify. We just kind of get a, did a glance over when we bought it that the, everything was in there. We're pretty sure that it is. Um, it's not until... Um, Less, it's not until the 13th card. So, like, you get a lot of how to use a data notebook, which, you know, how to, how to use a pipette, how to use your measuring cups, how to use a funnel. And then on, um, this is what the experiment cards look like. And so on card 13 is the first actual experiment. So you get the materials list where, and the little houses are what you get from home and what you get out of the kit. Um, and then there's the method and you, and then you do it. And then on the back is the explanation of what happened, which I really like. Um, the kit, the kit we used in pre-K didn't really have a good breakdown explanation for small, for younger children. And I feel like this d did a good job of breaking it down for young kids. Um, and so there's, a whole big bunch of them. Um, I will say this is a nitpick thing. Um, I don't know if it's just that mine were uh, that my, the one that the kit that we got was open when we bought it, and that somebody had rifled through or what. But the cards when I went got it home and were looking at it, the cards were out of order, which meant that I, being kind of a little anal retentive, want everything in order and the way it's supposed to be. So I. Uh, took the time to actually put everything in order. Um, so back here in the back of the bus is where all of that stuff that I showed you that comes in there is actually is. 
Um, here's your data notebook, just kind of a flat, you know, little brochure like thing. I don't know that we'll use this with kindergarten, but there you go. Um, my daughter has seen a video of somebody making slime recently and joyous day. She's begging to do it. So because she's begging and it's science and it came in the magic school bus kit, that's what this glue is for. Um, we'll probably be doing it. And heck, with, with a bottle of glue this small, I'm hoping that means that it's not a whole lot. Um, one of the things I was kind of glad that it had, because we didn't actually have them this year, and I feel like it's good training, is it did came with a actually pretty nice pair of children's goggles. Um, vented on the sides, durable plastic, Um, fairly comfortable. Um, I will definitely be having her use these when we do experiments, either in this or in any of the other labs that we do. Um, the test tubes are plastic. Um, so they're super small test tubes, but they are plastic. But they're it's kind of nice that we'll have a different size test tube. You get two little kind of flimsy, but actually not too bad rulers. Um, so you get two of those. Um, the pipette, it's just a standard kind of pipette. Um, I bet you could probably get a whole bulk of these for fairly cheap on Amazon, but it's nice to have it. Um, it does come with a pencil, I was surprised. Um, so, and and there's here's like some of the different stuff that's in here. Let's see, I think that's it. Yep. So that's what comes in the kits. And um, overall, I'm pretty impressed with the quality. Like I said, we have not done these yet, but um, I could see just based on after having read through some of it, I could see this being appropriate for element elementary, definitely. Um, I'm not entirely sure how much we'll get out of it at the kindergarten level. Um, it's more of a exploring the idea of science at kindergarten level for in us in our house. Um, Definitely first grade, definitely second, third, or fourth. Um, fifth, I don't know. I haven't looked up into fifth grade very much. Um, engineering is the same way. You got your cards. And I'll show you the index and the what's, what's in there. So this is what's in there. And this is what comes in the engineering kit. Um, and now that I'm looking at it, it looks like there are only 33 experiments in the um, engineering kit, not the 51 cards that are in the chemistry lab set. Um, I actually haven't gone through this one yet, but oh, cool, there's a solar panel. Um, that's what's in this one. Um, and then I... I really like it. I'm really excited about it. I like that everything's all together. Okay. Come on. Nothing ever wanna work when you want to. So again, there's another data notebook. Some cables, a flashlight, some other stuff in there. Interestingly, there, there's glue. So that's what these are. Um, I'm really excited about them. I was thrilled to pieces when I saw them on clearance and I snatched them up um, and especially at the $20 price range I didn't even bat an eye and that's what those are um, thanks for watching everybody bye